It had been snowing in the garden, and everywhere was magical and white. Oakley told Rosie and her friends the story about a mysterious creature called the Abominable Snowman. Nobody has ever seen him, only a trail of giant footprints in the snow. Big Bear decides to set off in search of the Abominable Snowman. Meanwhile, Rosie spots Archie shivering. He admits he has never seen snow before and turns blue with cold. Holly lends Archie a woolly hat and scarf borrowed from her teddy. Archie asks his friends what you do with snow. Snowballs, cries Will excitedly. Skiing, shouts Raggles. Skating, adds Holly. Archie thinks whatever they do, he will be brilliant at it. Bluebird demonstrates how to make snow angels. Archie tries to make a snow angel, but only ends up making a mess. Meanwhile, Big Bear gets excited when he finds a set of giant footprints in the snow. I think you're following your own footprints, giggles Rosie. An embarrassed Big Bear asks Rosie to help him look for more clues. Big Bear and Rosie find more strange footprints at the bottom of Oakley's Hill. But it's only Archie practicing how to make snow angels. Next, Will, Raggles, Holly and Bluebird show Archie how to ice skate. Holly performs a beautiful ice dance with her teddy. Now watch me! cries Archie, showing off. He slips and slides all over the ice, landing face first in a pile of snow. Archie isn't hurt, but thinks ice skating might not be his thing. Raggles suggests a race across the snow on skis instead. Archie thinks he will definitely win this time. Rosie asks Big Bear what he thinks the abominable snowman looks like. Well, he's big, replies Big Bear, but I don't think he likes to be seen. Maybe he's shy, adds Rosie. Rosie and Big Bear find themselves at the centre of the maze. I think we're about to see the abominable snowman, exclaims Rosie. But they find Raggles making prints with his tennis racket snowshoes. Poor Archie is upset when he comes last in the snow race. He wonders when he will find a snowy day activity that he is good at. Will suggests sledging down Oakley's hill, but Archie's tea tray gets stuck in the snow. Big Bear finds some even bigger footprints and thinks these must belong to the abominable snowman. They're enormous, exclaims Big Bear. Unfortunately, the prints are being made by Teal and Manny trying to carry a nest. <coughs> Big Bear is ready to give up his search. I don't think we're ever going to find the mysterious, abominable snowman, he says, disappointedly. Rosie thinks perhaps it is just a story after all, just like Oakley said. Back on Oakley's Hill, Will suggests a snowman building competition. Archie thinks he can build the biggest snowman ever. The friends show off the snowman they have built. I present to you the biggest snowman you have ever seen, announces Archie proudly. Unfortunately, Archie's snowman is the tiniest one, and he is deflated. Aww. As Archie leans on his snowman, 
the mounds of snow start to roll down the hill. Hey, stop! calls Archie as the snowballs gather speed, getting bigger and bigger. Archie jumps on top of the giant snowball, which crashes into Big Bear. Ay, caramba! shouts Archie as the snowball explodes. Big Bear is covered from head to toe in snow and has a carrot stuck to his nose. Big Bear, giggles Rosie, you look like a giant snowman. Archie puts the finishing touches to Big Bear by adding some buttons to his tummy. I may not have found the abominable snowman, but look, I'm the abominable snow bear, <laughs> chuckles Big Bear.